the wing, Nwaba. Hey, puts up a three. Bradley grabs the board. Chicago leading. The kick out to Williams. Back to MP. To the paint. And Williams punches it home. The playmaking ability of MP. Good at reading defenses and making the right decision. To the wing on the left. Here's Shengun. Oh, and Bradley with a block. MP, the pass to White. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. The assist numbers certainly stand out. <laughs> They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Gordon, right side. Porter in the post, working on Williams. Gordon outside. Another miss. They desperately need a bucket. Now here's MP. He's guarded closely. Williams' shot is good. Williams has got his second basket of the game. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Now a timeout called by Houston. Last time they met was in Houston. Today's game is about effort and energy. They got crushed on the glass the last time these teams played. If you don't have that one guy who gets you 10-plus boards every night, you just have to send more guys to the glass. And the Bulls making a change here. Green is checked in. Here's Gordon. No good there. Good work defensively by White. Down low. Here's Caruso. Takes it up with both hands and rips it down. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. Here's Gordon. Following the bucket by the Bulls. Pass to Nwaba. To the middle. Here's Shangun. And the dunk to finish it off. A beauty. And just a lack of fight right now on the defensive end. Yeah, defensively, your mantra at this point has to be no easy buckets. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team. Girl. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. And he knocks down the first one. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Down low. Here's Green. Lays it up and banks it in. The offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. This is my type of approach. Get some high percentage looks. Then later, you can play inside out. And a double-digit lead on the scoreboard as we end the first quarter of play. It's the Bulls, up by 15. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. And no question, John Wall at his best attacking the rim. But he said when his shot is falling, it's a whole different ball game. Uh, when my jump shot's going, it opens up the floor so much more for me and my teammates and giving those guys open looks. And uh, it's just the hard work I put in, and these guys trusted and believed in me of being able to knock down open shots. And Grant, over his career, Wall, frankly, hasn't been the most efficient scorer. Yeah, he really hasn't. I mean, a tremendous playmaker, but his jump shot is pivotal. If he gets that dialed in, it could really help his game. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Chicago. They've gotten a lot of high-quality shots in the paint early on. That was clearly part of their game plan coming in. Another aspect of their game that's been super so far tonight is how they've been sharing the ball and piling up the assist. This is how the floor looks for the Rockets starting the second. They've got Eric Gordon. David Nwaba is out there with Kenyon Martin. Then there's Kevin Porter, and it's Shangun in at the five. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Lakers was a man on a mission. He picked up 38 points, and that was just one element of his production. He ended up with a triple-double on the night. He put up huge numbers last time out. We'll see if it's more of the same tonight, guys. 
Outstanding, thanks. Impressive ability to carry his team to victory, Grant. Yeah, B.A., I was really impressed. They wouldn't have won the game if it wasn't for his attacking mindset and will to win. And that allows you to impact the game even if the shot isn't falling. Vucevic, he's checked in for Chicago. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And Smitty, you had pretty good size on the wing. When you were attacking mismatches, did you prefer to bully a smaller player or pick apart a bigger, slower defender? You know, it would be a great question. I think both. I think when you have a mismatch, what you really want to do is draw a double team. So if you can use your size or your quickness. But I'll Substitution for the Rockets. MP outside. Poke loose. Pass to Levine. Drains it. Now he's three for five. Woo! Zach barely gave the defense a chance there. He quickly gets the shot in the air. Houston has gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. Outside Porter. Outside Levine. Low block shot. Here's Bradley. Drops in the layup for two. And it's a six-point Bulls lead. Their strong work ethic has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. The Rockets shooting has been great this game. 58%. Gordon against Levine. To the inside. Here's Shangoon. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. And the first one at the line is good. And give them credit for making a more concerted effort to get to the line this quarter. That one falls, so he hits both of them. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. MP. And MP throws it down. What separates MP from a lot of players is that natural burst. It is so fast. So it's the Rockets now. Six-point game. They defeated Detroit in their last game. Oh, my. Talk about mental toughness. The crowd was roaring against them. But they were able to focus and finish the task at hand. It was a terrific performance we got a chance to watch. They got into a nice rhythm and made smart adjustments along the way. MP drives in. And he dunks it. What a pass to set him up. Mm, slams it down with 101 left in the first half. Here's Porter. There's the drive. And then Porter with the dunk. What? Wait. Hey, dunks are always for the big boys. <laughs> Emphatic move by the point guard. Forget just landed in. He wanted to make a statement to the paint. Here's Bradley. And another dime for him. That makes 15 assists. He has been one step ahead of the defense all game long. The Rockets trail. 36 seconds left to play in the first half of basketball. Inside from eight feet. Outside for Porter. Five to shoot. Gordon outside. From the arc. It's hauled in by the Bulls. I'll tell you what. They've been aggressive and they've been physical. Here's Levine. Gordon pulls it in. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession. Except for the result. Takes the three. Oh, and he hits it at the buzzer. Monster buzzer beater. Helps carve into that deficit. It's anyone's game now. And the first half comes to an end. We've got a close game going here. It's the Bulls leading by three. We'll take a quick break and then get you back to the action. in that first half we saw a pretty tight battle we'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime boy we're seeing a tremendous game from john wall 
through the first two quarters, he's been on fire. Explosive offensive performance. This is his challenge, to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. Ball and Levine make up the backcourt. Nikola Vucevic is out there with DeMar DeRozan. And it's MP in at the three. That's the group for Billy Donovan getting going here in the second half. Basket counts. Vucevic has got ten. They have no answer defensively inside. Ball against Wall. To the inside. Here's Wood. Vucevic with some nice D. Chicago leading. One thing you gotta love about Nikola Vucevic is point shot. And of course, he regularly posts big point totals. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. I like that approach, playing inside out, forcing the defense to scramble. Well, there's no denying that Vucevic's offensive output really makes him a great example of a modern big. Yeah, his abilities at long range definitely help stretch the floor. But he can also be an old-school menace down low, gobbling up rebounds and owning the paint. They get it back. Here's Vucevic. Tough sequence there. They just couldn't get it to go. The Rockets have gone just one of three in the second half. And there's the whistle. They'll pin that one on Nikola Vucevic. That's foul number two for him. His second personal foul. First team foul. Just over a minute and a half played in the third. Tice finds Green. Pass to Tate. The three is up. And that comes off the assist by Green. He's got five. That's a shot the defense looked like it was willing to give up. Big mistake. Now here's MP. He has seven. And there it is for him. That's ten straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. So it's the Rockets now. Trailing by four. Ball against ball. And rejected. When you mix balls length with this timing, the result is a quality defensive play. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read to the paint. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Great game for him. Double-double now. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. Ball against Wall. Shot clock at five. Outside, green. And a miss there on the triple. The Bulls have gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. MP, the pass to Ball. And he slams it in one-handed. If you're Lonzo, this is how you want to use your limp. Attack the rim. Ball against Ball. Ball, no good. Good job hitting the glass. There by Wall. MP, the pass to Ball. Oh, a rip rattling two-handed jam. And he just driving the stake in him there. He's a guy who just never lets up. And the defense knows he's relentless. You have to try and match that intensity. Here's Wall. Deflects the pass. And Wood with the stuff. I'll tell you, he is so tough to keep down once he gets near that rim. Yeah, he can get up even a few notches higher. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And you get some traditional big man stuff from Wood. If you look at his handles, going one-on-one -on -one outside the painted area, most centers can't do all the things that he can do. Some changes for Chicago. Green's checked in for DeRozan. The Sunmu comes in for Zach. Oh, wow! Oh, my goodness! Oh, a flashy dunk from MP, showing everyone just how acrobatic he can be. And that replay courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. White against Wall. Step back and fire. And too long on the shot. 
It's been an ugly quarter for him. Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. Outside Tate for three. It's hauled in by White. The Bulls have gone 7 of 10 here in the second half. Here's MP. He's got it going on. Now 7 for 10. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. To the middle. Here's Wood. And it's MP with a rebound. MP's got his 7th rebound here tonight. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Count it. And now it's a 12-point Bulls lead. I love this game plan. That's 10 points in a row from in close. Wall against White. And up the court come the Bulls on the break. Oh, there's the alley. And MP throws it down. Oh, there's no stopping that. Timeout call. Houston. Coach definitely wants to talk about their interior defense, which has not been impressive. It's a matter of want to. Helping out, contesting shots. You have to want to make the effort. Houston has gone just one of three from deep since the break. The foul called on MP. That'll be a second foul of the game. And Grant, in 2015, you became part owner of the Atlanta Hawks. How pleased were you to see their performance in last year's playoffs? Well, it was incredible. So much fun to see this team come together, rally, and have an incredible run in this past postseason. Now, as a broadcaster, you don't want to have a rooting interest, but I'll confess, it was definitely special to see. Here's MP, and that one goes. Now 10 for 13 on the night. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Pass to Nwaba. 152 left in the third quarter. Here's Shangun. Oh, and Bradley with a block. Nwaba against MP. Here's Bradley. Back to MP. Down low. Bradley misses. MP up top. Can't get it to go, and Houston will come the other way. It's stolen by MP. Driving in, and MP throws it down. MP is spilling it right now. Just get him to rock and let him do his thing. A minute 15 left in the third, and the Rockets call time here. MP really making a difference here. This guy is killing you, and so far I haven't seen a good adjustment defensively. Bulls making a switch here. Williams is checked in. We've got 113 left in the third. And the foul called on MP. That's his third foul so far. His third personal foul. Third team foul. 111 left to play in the third. To the middle. It's stolen by Green. Right idea. Wrong execution. They were looking to get attack. Oh, what awareness from MP. When the break is on, he knows exactly where to go. Boy, the Rockets really having a tough go here. And here's Gordon. Give him eight to halt the run. Second shot opportunity. Two points. That one goes. Give him eight. Relentless on the offensive glass, and then you love the finish. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. That's his first personal foul. We'll never question MP's toughness. I mean, he's willing to take a few lumps down low if it means points. <laughs> or a trip to the line. Green's checked in for Noaba. There's 38 seconds left in the third quarter. Houston has gone just one of three from deep since the break. Gordon finds Porter. Pass to Green. 
Five on the clock. Here's Shangun. Rebound by the Bulls. MP with it. 26 points for him. Using his post moves to get the two points. MP's got 28. Just an assertive play from MP down low. Getting around the contact and right to the bucket. And so it looks like it'll be Houston's ball. Rocket ball. And so it's MP making things happen for the Bulls. Piling up the numbers that quarter. Already, he's got a double-double. All right, stick around. We'll be right back after this. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. And from the two-guard spot, an unselfish play like this sets a fantastic tone. Whatever the offense requires, that has to be your mindset. Always thinking, team first. Substitution here for Chicago. Nikola Vucevic is checked in for Williams. MP comes in for Zach Levine. The Sumu, he's checked in for White. And it's Ball in for Caruso. Christian Wood is checked in for the Rockets. John Wall comes in for Porter Jr. I mean, what patience in the pick and roll. MP just taking what the defense gives him. So on the floor for Houston. Green the two with Gordon the three. Then there's John Wall. Then there's Christian Wood. And it's Shangun in at the four-man position. Pass to Vucevic. Ball outside. MP outside. Driving inside. And MP throws it down. They'll take that look every time. MP with the easy finish. Outside wall. And he's 6 for 12 after that one. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. MP, the pass to DeRozan. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. DeMar DeRozan's bread and butter. He has a great feel from the mid-range. Pass to Green. Wall against DeRozan. Wall, the pass to Gordon. Shot clock at six. Takes it inside. Late clock. Houston's got to hurry. Wood. And Wood with the stuff. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. He has really come into this second half on an absolute tear. Really impressive effort from him so far. Green for three. Another score. His fifth make out of ten tries. For three. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific groove right now. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. And again, another assist. And that's his 20th assist. Wow. He's doing a great job at orchestrating the offense. Ball against ball. Ball no good. Chicago has gone 6 of 14 from the perimeter tonight. Pass to Vucevic. Ooh, making his presence felt here. He's now 6 for 9 in this game. And it gets even worse for them. I mean, he just waltzes down the lane, extending their advantage. Ugh, not good. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. Chicago's gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. MP drives in. Good chance here for Ball. Again, the Bulls score. Alonzo has been working on that, shooting off the catch with confidence and without hesitation. Outside, Green. Back to Wall. Over Ball. Out to Gordon. Launches a three. And it's cleared by Vucevic. 
Vucevic just got his eighth rebound here tonight. Not his best night, and not the team's best night. Sometimes it just goes that way. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. This has been an impressive performance tonight. Even with a big lead, they've maintained their focus. Out to Gordon. And Grant, you've been around the game in so many roles. Been a player, broadcaster, owner. Talk about how the game has grown and the opportunities for continued growth. Well, we know how the game here in the U.S. has really gained prominence and is hugely successful and popular. And I also think that's happened over the years globally as well. But continuing to popularize the game in Africa, India, China, and elsewhere is exciting. There are so many new frontiers for this league to grow, and I'm excited that we're moving forward in that Two direction. Remaining in the game. Here's Two Wood, minutes. and he banks in the layup. Christian High Wood. offensive IQ. He makes great reads and adjustments on the fly. Wood against MP. One forty-four left in the fourth quarter here. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Vucevic, good, and the assist goes to MP. Vucevic has got six here in the quarter. Here's Wall. That one's wide left. And the truth is, I've been there. He's trying to find the rhythm on his shot. He feels like he's close, and that's why he keeps shooting. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Bulls. And you don't usually see this kind of blowout, but tonight they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. And so hard work pays off with their 26th win of the year. And that's a sweep of the season series. It's clear who the matchup favored. They'll wish they could have seen more of these guys. And of all the highlights and performances we've seen here tonight, the one thing that stands out is what an unbelievable night it's been for MP. An all-around dominant performance. Only certain guys can do this. Complete control. Three phases of the game. Congrats. A triple-double. And another miss by Houston. There was a mix-up defensively. Left him all alone. He just couldn't hit it. Buries it down low. MP's got 38 points. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Chicago with the ball. Now MP. Drives to the hoop. Oh, and the dunk by MP. <laughs> this has to feel good. They gave their fans a show and secured the W. They're going to win by a nice margin. The effort was there all night. Left side green. The three-pointer off the mark. So it's the Bulls winning this one easily. Showing that they're the far superior team. They win it going away. I'll tell you what. Give it up for their fans. They love to watch this team dominate. You best believe they're all going home happy tonight. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Steve Smith, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, I'm Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching this 2K Sports coverage of the NBA. We'll see you next time.